my Sagittarius is L here to do your February 2018 uh, general monthly reading. Whatever comes out is what comes out. Hopefully it's what you want to hear. I have shuffled and prayed over the cards off camera. I'll save the intro for the end. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you're feeling moved, please do so. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. It's much appreciated. All right. Let's go. Thank you for the messages for Sagittarius. True, accurate messages for Sagittarius. Thank you for the messages for Sagittarius. Thank you for the messages for Sagittarius. All right, and you show up in your reading, Sagittarius, temperance. Either you need to balance yourself or you are balanced. It's perfect timing in regards to maybe a relationship. Wow, and there's you, the Queen of Wands. Definitely perfect timing to offer love or accept love. Offer it to you. Maybe from a younger or younger fire, I mean, younger earth sign. If not in a younger earth sign, it's just that the relationship, the partnership is still in its infancy. It's still new. You know, there's no offer here, but the, the messages of you know, of a partnership or here. It's like you knowing that you could actually partner with this person, but you haven't offered anything and they haven't offered you anything. Okay. Three of swords. It might be three of swords here because you are offering or someone's offering you something and you're already in a relationship. Hmm. Three of Swords, divorce, separation, needing to ca to practice caution in relationship due to uh, infidelity. All right. Right, the moon is here. The Ten of Wands. Some of you have, some of my sads have gone out of the relationship they're doing it in secret it's becoming a burden they really just want to leave behind the partnership they're already in and move forward alone um yeah yeah what i say move forward alone the chariot holds one uh you may be trying to get to a cancer you may be causing heartbreak in this relationship because you want to be single. And you may actually be mentally checking out, physically moving. Six of Swords. Or at least making the decision to move away from... You could be dealing with an Aquarius. You might be making a decision to move away from an Aquarius. If you're in a relationship with an Aquarius. Or making a decision to heal and have restoration in a relationship. Knight of Pentacles. There's the offer. Justice. This might be like the offering of, right, Seven of Swords, the Emperor, the Nine of Nine of Pinnacle, Page of One, and then the Hangman. Yeah, that's the offer. This Knight of Knight of Pinnacles and the Justice is the offer of. Uh, some monetary settlement probably in a divorce you get the justice here and the three of swords um, because uh, then we have the seven of swords behind it all because someone is you know really devising a plan of action 
to get in control of their life and their destiny in which they want to be single and, and stable. And then they can have that call to action to take action, maybe with a Pisces, or if not with the Pisces, this the newfound singlehood puts them at a standstill, but this is what they wanted. Ace of Pentacles, um, newfound way of making money, a, a large purchase, uh, engagement, moving in together. Right, Knight of Wands, Strength card. Someone's being bold and courageous and moving towards someone offering something stable and passionate and doing it really quickly. Having the strength to do so after getting themselves out of partnership. There's way too many. Strength card, three of cups. Someone wants reconciliation. They're hoping and praying for it. The will of fortune is here, supposed to happen. Judgment is coming back around for a second time, even though it's causing betrayal, heartbreak. But someone wants to partner with someone else. They feel stuck in an established relationship. It looks like they're going to make the decision to chart a new path emotionally check out or physically move away and start a new development that brings them the ultimate level of happiness. Wow. So Sagittarius, if this is not you, then it's someone around you. Um, they want out. They and They're devising a plan to get out. Uh, they, they no longer want the relationship that they're in. If it's not you, then it's your partner. Cross watchers, Sagittarius might want out. I don't know. All right, let's get a butterfly oracle card in here to help Tie everything in. Give some guidance. Thank you, Heavenly Angels, for true, accurate messages for Sagittarius in regards to their love life, career, and finance. Love and career and finance. What should they be focused on from now and going into March? Yeah, we've got heavenly signs, adult children, self-employment. I, I felt that, definitely felt that. So some of you need to be focused on self-employment. If you're not already engaged in it or you're thinking about it, this is confirmation. Some of you have adult children. Some of you are adult children. Um... If you have adult children, they're coming to the forefront for some reason or, or another. They're on your mind. There might be some heavenly signs in, in regards to your adult children, what's going on with them, if they need help or vice versa, you needing help. You might can reach out to your adult children. Heavenly signs in regards to self-employment. If you've been feeling like this is the way to go, if you think about opening that food truck and then you see an ad in the local listing for someone selling a food truck. Heavenly signs. Uh, some beautiful energy here. So um, it looks like my Sages are devising plans to get out of partnership, to focus on self-employment with that Nine of Pentacles, that um, the Emperor. And the King of Wands, 
definitely um, entrepreneurship. Okay, so if this reading resonated with you, please definitely like, share, comment to the channel, to the video. Uh, request a personal reading by emailing me. My email address is below. All information below is below. All information is below. Um, but my email address is tarotofl at gmail.com. Follow me on Instago. It's a new app you can use uh, to uh, ask me a question. I'll pull a few cards, get back to you pretty quickly, fairly quickly. Um, what else? Follow me on Instagram. My handles are below. Choose to fund the page by clicking the GoFundMe link. I think that sums everything up. Uh, thank you for tuning in, guys. Um, I'll get some more fun little spreads out for you, okay? All right, so um, happy Valentine's Day. Um, I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Remember, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care.